Today's flashback story takes place 1-17-1985 at 0330 hours. It is a double fatal fire that takes place at 102 Nightingale Street in Dorchester. Sam Brown, who I believe was the owner of the house, lived on the third floor of the three-decker with his wife, his son, and his two daughters. He was awakened around 3.30 in the morning to hear his wife Gloria yelling, Sam, Sam, get up, fire. Sam and his two daughters, Jacqueline and Catherine, made it to the third floor front porch. A neighbor, Lorraine Moles, heard was awakened by screams. She went outside to see what was going on and saw the three of them on the third floor porch. She dragged a mattress out of her house and put it in front of 102 and told them to jump as she could see smoke and fire rising behind them. Fortunately, Boston Fire made it there in time to take them down from the porch over ladders. Sam's wife, Gloria, had run to the rear of the apartment, which was where the kitchen was. That was the last that Sam saw of his wife. Neighbors told Sam that they had seen his son uh, escape the building, but then return back into the building because he couldn't find his mother. Sam had tried to re-enter the house himself, but was driven back by smoke and flames. Firefighters later found Larry Brown's body in the kitchen and his 35-year-old mother's body in a room off of the kitchen. Both were taken to Boston City Hospital and were pronounced dead. Deputy Fire Chief John Harrison said that he believed the fire was set and an accelerant was used in the front hall stairway. Boston Police Homicide Unit investigated the fire. Occupants of the first and second floor of the uh, fire building made it out okay. Brown's two German Shepherd dogs were also killed in the fire. So there were two fatalities in the fire, Brown's wife and Brown's son. Two firefighters suffered minor injuries when they fell through a staircase from the third floor to the uh, first floor. Well, anyhow, that's our flashback story for today. If you like these stories, uh, I'd appreciate it if you clicked on the like button, which is the thumbs up sign underneath this video. And also, you might want to subscribe. That way you'll be updated when new videos are put up. To see the actual video of this fire, click on the link beneath this video, and that will take you right to it. Once you're there, if you want to come back here, click on the link beneath that video that says Return. Well, anyhow, stay safe out there. Keep the rubber side down. Remember, there's danger everywhere. And also, remember, I'll be back.